Oh, hello, and welcome to the Collaboratory at Kentucky Wesleyan Center for Engaged Teaching and Learning. Today, I'm here to talk to you about the light board. Now, you may remember the light board from last year, a single pane of glass lit internally that allowed us to write while facing our virtual students. Last year, the capabilities for this board ex uh, existed solely of being able to write on the glass to where if we wanted to talk about a concept, we could come in and write on the glass. Like this. However, over the last summer, Crystal Homorski and I have been busy expanding the, the capabilities of the light board. We now have the ability to embed PowerPoint presentations or any other content from a computer into the video. You have the ability to come in with your normal class materials and present them as you would in a regular class, but have the ability to send the video out to your students beforehand, so hopefully they will come to class better prepared. An example of when I might want to use this type of video is if I want to give my students some information or a problem that they're going to be working on, but that's not the main focus of the video. If I need room to work or room to write, I can have all of this space to work with still. However, there are going to be times whenever I want the content on the computer to be the focus of the presentation. And in that case, I can switch to a video like this, where majority of the screen is used by the computer, uh, but my video is still embedded into the bottom. So in this case, if I'm trying to talk about this problem given here, I can say, okay, we want to do the implicit derivative of x to the fourth plus y squared plus y is equal to one, and I can walk them through that information. Now, before you start to head for the exits, uh, because I'm about to do calculus, I'm going to stop here, and I want to just give you a brief demonstration of the capabilities of the light board. One other thing about this light board is if we want to embed the PowerPoint presentations into the video, we also have the ability to move the embedded video around. So if you're more comfortable working above, you can have your video down here. If you're more comfortable working below, you can have your video up top. Um, it is completely drag and drop and up to you. If you have questions about how you can utilize this resource in your classrooms, you can talk to Christine Salmon in the Center for Engaged Teaching and Learning or talk to Crystal or myself. Uh, thank you, and uh, we're hoping that you'll look into utilizing, utilizing this new resource.